on CNC or computer numerical controlled grinders. Machine controls and digital scales govern all axis motions. Under CNC control, the part program governs the motions of the grinder and produces the program shape. CNC grinders reduce setup time, increase flexibility in production, and make parts which are more uniform and predictable for consistent quality. Wheel dressing is usually an automatic cycle controlled by the CNC. CNC has expanded the types of shapes cylindrical grinders can generate. A single part may have numerous operations combined in a single setup. Wheels should be visually inspected before use to assure that a wheel isn't cracked ring test it using a non-metal object. A good wheel will have a clear ringing sound. A cracked wheel will not. With conventional abrasive wheels, dressing alters the wheel's cutting action by renewing the wheel surface. This is achieved by removing or fracturing dull grains with a diamond dressing tool. Dressing also removes tiny pieces of workpiece material from the pores of the wheel. These particles load the wheel, make it cut poorly, and can result in burn and chatter marks on the workpiece. Many grinders are equipped with automatic dressing cycles to periodically dress the wheel and automatically adjust for the material removed from the wheel. Light dressing passes are the rule. On conventional wheels, a single point diamond removes about one thousandth of an inch or twenty-five thousandths of a millimeter per pass. Cluster or multi-point tools may take up to five times that per pass. Careful control of friction is more significant in grinding than in other machining operations. Friction can be controlled by grinding fluids that lubricate the process, remove heat and swore from the grinding zone, and maintain temperature in the grinding zone. Efficient cooling reduces the grinding power requirement, maintains work quality, and stabilizes part dimensions over long production runs. Insufficient fluid reaching a work surface may result in heat damage. Grinding fluids include emulsions, synthetic lubricants, and grinding oils. The most common method of supplying coolant is flood coolant delivered through one or more nozzles to flood the work area. High pressure coolant jets can be used to clean the wheel face.